In the seventh example, I'm going to use the most popular HC-SR04 ultrasonic sensor with the Raspberry Pi Pico. You know, ultrasonic sensor is one of the most commonly used sensors and is usually used for obstacle detection and robotics. It is also used for monitoring the water level and so on. For now, I'll make a simple distance meter and you will be able to see the measured distance on the OLED display module. So let's go ahead and take a look at the circuit diagram. The SSD1306 OLED display module connections with the Raspberry Pi Pico remains exactly the same. The VCC pin is connected with the VBUS which is pin 40 of the Raspberry Pi Pico. Trigger pin is connected with GP3. Echo pin is connected with GP2 and the ground pin of the ultrasonic sensor is connected with the ground pin of the Raspberry Pi Pico board. I completed my connections as per the circuit diagram and now let's take a look at the programming. The SSD1306 OLED display module code remains exactly the same. This time I defined the trigger and echo pins which are connected with GP3 and GP2. I defined the trigger pin as the output and the echo pin as the input. The actual code is placed inside this distance function which measures the time duration of the signal as it travels from the transmitter to the receiver. Finally, the measure time is converted into centimeters and then divided by two to get the actual distance, while these other lines of code simply display the text and measure distance on the OLED display module. Now let's go ahead and run this code. I just built myself a distance meter. Now I can use this for obstacle detection, for controlling an electronic door lock, for measuring the water level inside a water tank, for controlling lights and so on. 